civil society organizations, academic institutions from all around the world. And the major issue today is for the movement to have its voice heard on the issues of healthcare and the health rights which are going on, uh, more especially here in Nairobi. So for today, we will have a number of uh, representatives to speak. We will start with uh, Dan Owana, who will go first to tell us why we are here and what issues we are going to cover. Then the others will come later on. Uh, we have Colin Stiko, Colin Stiko. Uh, he will speak about some of the issues, followed by William Tony, and finally Jordan, or Jordan and Catherine. Jordan is over there. And then Catherine. Then at the end of the press conference, we will have a summary of everything which has been said in Swahili language. So feel most welcome, everyone, to the press conference. So I would invite Jordan, uh, sorry, Dan, to go first. Thank you, George. Ladies and gentlemen, People's Health Movement Kenya statement on the issue of Humani maternity, hospital, and the state of healthcare in Nairobi County. Our attention as civil society organization has been drawn to the ongoing matter at the Mwani Maternity Hospital. Health is a fundamental human rights issue and the government is obligated by law to provide quality health services to all citizens. There is no doubt that Nairobi County Government is directly responsible for county health facilities and pharmacies as stipulated under Schedule 4 of the Constitution. The convening of this press conference is informed by the deteriorating healthcare provision and retrogression of gains made in health service delivery over years. The interest is to safeguard the poor and marginalized communities and mothers in particular that in their absolute state rely on public facilities as their remedy. It should be noted categorically that the dysfunction at Pumwani Maternity Hospital is not an isolated case, but rather part of the systemic failures of public health care in Nairobi County. It further illustrates the undignified treatment that patients experience in their bid to find affordable and quality health care. The issue highlighted in Pumwani are historical based on the previous happenings including the miracle babies, the inhuman treatment of mothers, stealing of babies, and detention of mothers among others. This must be strategically and objectively, ad uh, uh, and objectively addressed to provide a sustainable and lasting solution. With this in mind, we would like to observe the following. One, 